Today we're checking out an olive green PLA filament for 3D printing. And this is produced by Eerie One. I'm not sure how to pronounce that name properly. And this is a product that I've bought myself and I wanted to try it out because I've been doing a lot of stuff like tanks and I was really interested to see how this would do compared to spray painting my 3D prints olive green like I normally do. And right away it feels very different from other PLAs that I've tried. It's got a very kind of chalky texture when you touch it. And I was wondering if the final product was going to be more brittle because of it. But I was glad to say that was not the case. So the first print I've done with this is a German Leopard tank. And I think it comes out really, really good. And I've got zero complaints. I also didn't change any of my print settings. So I'm just printing it as normal PLA. And it came out beautiful on the K1 from Creality. And you will have also noticed that I brought in my HIMARS launcher as an example there. Because that one I printed off in black and then spray painted it olive green. And this is a little bit lighter, but I got to say the overall look of it, I think is very, very nice. Here you can see the actual details and it's definitely not perfect, but I would say that there's nothing particularly bad about it either. So yeah, I think it's really good. And I was very, very happy with how this filament ended up coming out. And it will save me having to spray paint something after I print it. So of course, I can just do any tanks and stuff now in this filament. And that means I can now skip an entire process I would normally do. And of course, I no longer have to pay for the spray paint. So overall, win-win, I think.